Do you think it's possible to sleep comfortably in the back of a two-door Ford Bronco? I'm Nate with Deep Sleep and I'm here to show you the newest size in our line of solo mats and how you can sleep comfortably with over six feet of room. Let's check it out. One of the challenges that we were met with with designing for this space is the configuration of the seats. I'm gonna show you both ways. We're only gonna utilize one though. The first way is where the seat folds up straight and then the seat back folds down. But then there's less than four feet of sleeping room because we're losing all of this valuable area. The second way, with the seat pulled forward and the seat back laid down, it's going to give you a little bit of an incline. If you don't want to sleep that way and you want a flat sleeping surface, there's one extra step and I'm going to show you. If you have the toolkit from Ford for the hardtop, utilizing the wrench and a T40 Torx bit. We can remove these two bolts. After the seat's removed, go ahead and put the bolts back into the holes so that you don't lose them. Now with the seat removed, you can either put it in the front seat or use it to fill this gap on the floor. Once the seats are laid flat, you're ready to install your solo mat. The kit's gonna come with a leveling mat as well as the solo mat to fill the back cargo void. When car camping, space can be an issue. So instead of filling the footwell area with an inflatable space waster, this is where we recommend putting your clothing bag, a hiking pack, a small cooler, or your trail recovery bag. Lastly, our solo mats are a universal left or right fit. Two can go together to fill the whole space for door-to-door -door comfort, or you can choose to just use one and keep your gear next to you safely in your vehicle. One solo mat will give you exactly five feet of sleeping room. Two together will give you six foot three inches from corner to corner. Our design contours around the wheel well and the center console. 